in the world of TV, we have to talk about Disney Plus that's going to dominate all of our lives. Yes. Disney Plus has confirmed the addition of classic Marvel stories. Oh, I should say Marvel TV shows. Which that are you basically stories. Above. So, X-Men 92, Woo. the classic uh, Fantastic Four, Spider-Man and his amazing friends, the original Spider-Man, there's Iron Man, and the list goes on and on and on. Yep. So, uh, the reason we wanted to talk about this, aside from letting you all know that, yes, you should get this service. Uh, if you weren't already. Uh, uh, also, side note, no, we're not sponsored by Disney, but I am willing to take that money free. Uh, but, like, it's a great way to catch up on all of your comic book knowledge. So even if you don't read comics and you mm-hmm. want to know what's going on in these worlds, you can put those shows on and you can learn a lot. Totally. So like for me, I didn't know anything about comics. I didn't read comics. All I did was watch these shows religiously and I knew, oh, that's who Iceman was because it's Spider-Man and Amazing Friends. I was like, oh, that's uh, who Firebird is. Mm-hmm. That's who uh, Morbius is. That's who Spider-Man is. Like I got to like, feel these characters. Yeah. Now, some of these shows uh, may not hold up as well as you might have expected. Well, yeah, some of the older ones. Are exactly. But pretty. like, I think this is definitely something you could even have on in the background. Mm-hmm. Instead of watching The Office for the thousandth time, <laughs> you put this on. I mean, I do love The Office. I do love The I Office. I love The Office. I love it twice. I've, I've seen Netflix. it probably two or three times through. Uh, seven. Holy mother. No, I don't. Uh, like three. Jesus. I watched it. Three. Like seven? Three times. There's so many other I, things I've to watch. I sat down and watched it all once. Mm-hmm. Uh, and I've watched probably all the episodes again just yeah. by TV. I think stuff. Two. So probably two. Probably two for me. But I've watched it multiple episodes multiple times because I catch on TV. Oh, all yeah, time. they're great. But like I was saying, you can have it on in the background while you're doing other things. If you're playing video games or if you're like mm-hmm. doing cooking, just so you experience more like who these characters are. Because more than likely, this is where they're going to be cherry picking a lot of ideas and characters for future movies. So yep. if you want to be ahead of the game, especially X Men. Yes, X Men. Like guys, I'm telling you. So like, this is where you need to get your X Men yeah. knowledge on. I mean, in the '90s alone, right? Let's. We're 90s kids, so in the 90s alone, the X-Men show and the Spider-Man show mirrored the comic books almost perfectly. Did they? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Like, like X-Men alone was basically like the Claremont Jim Lee run. They did Days of Future Past. And they, oh, and they, did, they did Age of Apocalypse. They did everything. They did everything. Everything. They did. did um, they? they had even Rogue had Captain Marvel's powers, which started in the comics. Oh, yeah. Where she, but they didn't even explain it. Like, she just had her powers at the start of the TV show. Also, fun fact, the Avengers came on the X-Men and Spider-Man. They were... They, they, they like, were... It was like the first... Like They were always there. Yeah. Uh, Spider Man did Secret Wars with he the black did. suit. Uh, Ven- did Lethal Protector with Venom? Did oh, wow. uh, the Origin of Carnage? It did all the Todd McFarlane stuff. It did, it did Morbius, which is like eighties, early eighties, late seventies. Oh, guys, you gotta watch this. Like the Spider Man show did every every character did did Lizard, Mysterio. I love the Lizard. Electro. Like, I remember that one vividly. Yeah. Oh, you know what they did in Spider Man that freaked me out? Not freaked me out. I was like, what? Where he got this? The, the arms? Yeah, that's exactly. That was what the I was Morbius. Yep. I was like. He had more arms. He like, had six what is arms. That? Yep. That's so cool. I remember, like they this- did the origin of Black Cat in that. Remember, Felicia Hardy was just like his classmate. Yeah, and then they did her origin. And, and she became very Black seductive. Cat. Oh hell yeah! I was like, oh, what are you doing, about Spider-Man? The, I was all about the Black Cat. I was like, this is Mary Jane's woman. <laughs> but it was great. Like I got, I would, like I learned all these stuff, and then like did they I- do Death of Gwen Stacy? No. They did some Gwen Stacy, right? I don't remember Gwen. At I gotta all. see that again. But but like I remember like when we first met years ago now, mm-hmm. and like he's like, oh, you like this because I he knew I watched the show. He's like, oh, you should read this book. This has this story arc, and I was like, oh wait, I kind of know that. Is mm-hmm. it like this, this? And like before I met Chris, I was kind of like the the quote unquote like guy who knows a lot about comics. I was like, oh, this is like this. How do you know? I watch the cartoons when I was yeah. growing up. The cartoons gave a lot that whole '90s run your basic knowledge, and that's. Also, part of the genius that Marvel had was to get kids into comics without necessarily reading the comics. Because yeah. you're watching the TV show and you're basically giving them the comic books anyway. That's how they created this movie universe. Oh, uh, yeah. They brainwashed us since I was seven. But, like, Five, again, four, three. <laughs> those cartoons are, are amazing um, and rewatchable today. The 90s cartoons easily are, are some of the best. Um, yeah. So, yeah, definitely pick up Disney Plus if you're not. That's just another incentive on top of Mandalorian, on top of. All the live action Marvel TV shows and everything else. So, guys, give me a comment down below and let me know what you think of Disney Plus adding our favorite TV shows to the roster. Are you going to get Disney Plus? What's the first show? Tell me what the first show is that you're going to watch. No, I mean, like from the classic stuff. I oh, might I might rewatch X Men ninety two. Uh, yeah, X Men I think is for me. And Mandalorian Spider-Man. is the first like show show. Oh I'm yeah, watching. definitely. It's it's out day one. What's the first movie you're going to watch? Ooh. 
It has to be something new, right? Like, maybe Lady and the Tramp. Spider-Man. What, Far From Home? Uh, anyone. <laughs> um, might be Lady and the Tramp. Yeah? yeah Erica likes Lady and the Tramp. Oh, they're making, they're 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 making a live action. action. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about it. It's dogs. It's- yeah, but like the whole time you're basically like shipping dogs to bang each other. Think about it. Just blew your mind. I mean, I like the Siamese cats. <laughs> I like Aristocats. Aristocats That's a great bomb. movie. That's good. That's a bomb ass movie. 